Hi guys, it's Sebastian Bates here, the founder of the Warrior Academy and the host of the Warrior Academy podcast. Today, I wanted to share with you a short chapter from the book, Not a Victim. Not a Victim is a book I wrote in 2021 with the sole aim of helping parents mentor their children through the very, very difficult transition of bullying. Um, I also recorded it as an audio book. So if you'd like to have that book, then listen to this chapter, get a feel for what it's all about, and then have a look on Spotify or Audible for the audiobook, or even on Amazon for the physical book if you like a paper-based book. I really hope that it helps you prepare your child for the eventuality of going through bullying. Bullying is an inevitable but difficult transition that most of us go through in our lives. And as parents, I think it's really important we act proactively to prepare our children for the eventuality of having to go through it themselves. We can't always be there for our children, but we can give them the tools. We can empower them to face life's obstacles on their own. I hope you enjoy this chapter. Many of the problems we've observed in adolescence center around self-worth. They can last many years, It's at this time that young people are trying to find their place and get a grasp of who they are and what they are worth. With a negative self-inner critic and poorly developed self-esteem or self-image, this time can be damaging. A supportive community can identify weak areas, help young people take big steps to improve them and provide that emotional support. All of this gives young people the protective kit to weather the storm of adolescence and come out well-developed and ready for adulthood. There is much benefit gained during this challenging time. A young person asks themselves so many meaningful questions during adolescence, and with the right mentoring and support network, this provides a huge opportunity for introspective enlightenment. Separation and loss. Though not as common as the other two transitions, which almost every child will go through, Separation or loss is a major transition children must go through. By separation, we're referring to the separation of the child's parents, which inevitably involves the partial and sometimes complete separation of the child from one or another parent. Loss can apply to the child's parents as well as the child themselves and can be any of the following. Loss of a parent or parents. Loss of brothers or sisters loss of a child, loss of friends, loss of love, loss of a limb, loss of physical function, loss of work, loss of enjoyment of a hobby, loss of business or loss of money. We have had the privilege of working with some incredible single parents who live for many years in a toxic relationship, doing their best to raise their children in a harmful environment. Their children blossomed once the change occurred. In these cases, the separation benefited the child's development. We've also seen children watch their parents separate, which has caused huge emotional disruption to their mental health, social situation, and immediate community, and resulted in poor behavior, lowered confidence, and a lack of focus, increased risk of bullying, and difficulty trusting people in authority. I really hope you enjoyed today's Warrior Academy podcast episode. We're going to keep creating these episodes because I know that so many parents find them useful or get insights or get ideas about how to develop their child's character. But it all comes down to the three C's, confidence, conduct, and concentration. So if you want to get a deep insight into the levels of confidence your child has, the level of concentration they have, or the level of conduct they have, so that you can actually put a score next to it, and then work towards increasing those scores like we do in the Warrior Academy, then I'd love to invite you to fill in the breakthrough area assessment. It takes about five minutes of your time and you will get a personalized PDF report on your child's three C's. To access the breakthrough area assessment and find out your child's three C's score, all you need to do is go to www.breakthrougharea.com.